Welcome back. The city of Cape Town is planning to remove the carcass of a beached whale in Bantry Bay. The carcass washed ashore on a rocky section and its removal could be tricky. Now, For more on this, we're joined on the line by Greg Ulofsa from the city of Cape Town's Environmental Management Department. Greg, thank you so much for joining us. How do you go about moving something of this size? Uh, it's going to be difficult. We generally try and take these things off by the shore, but uh, the particular location of this animal means we're going to have to take it off by towing it back out to sea. Um, and we're, it's low tide at the moment, so we're going to be putting on a towing strap and then we'll wait for the tide to come in and a little bit later on try and tow it off and then take it around to an easy place where we can get it onto the truck and remove it. We're quite lucky because it's a small whale, it's a calf, it's about six metres in length and we estimate about six tonnes, so it makes it a little bit easier for us, but it's going to be a challenging afternoon. What kind of impact does a beaching have on the shore environment and why is it so important that the carcass is removed quickly? So the main reason we remove the carcasses is that um, whale carcasses, uh, when they start breaking down, put off a, a terrible smell and it's, uh, there's a bit of a public health risk. Uh, but generally it uh, becomes very uncomfortable for the local residents to have a, a rotting carcass. So our main focus is to do that. And then also as the carcass breaks down, it does pose a small risk to people in terms of attracting sharks to the area. So we've got a standard protocol in the city when we have a stranded or beached whale um, that we do remove them and we take them to fishes off landfill sites. And what, what's done with the carcass once it has been successfully removed from the area? Um, we take samples, DNA samples, which is provided to the national government's whale well program so that they can use it for research. And then, as per regulations, all of the uh, whales that we do remove are buried at fissures of landfill site. Any indication why the whale beached itself, especially considering that it's only a calf? Um, our strong suspicion at the moment is that it's been a boat strike. In other words, um, it was hit by a, a big uh, ship or vessel, and, and that's the reason that it was killed and it's been washed ashore. Uh, we'll confirm that later because the animal is currently lying on its back, so we can't see underneath. But I'm um, very much certain that that's likely to be the case. Well, thank you very much for that update. That was Greg Ulosa from the city of Cape Town.